hell is it? Do I have to play whack-a-mole again? Oh, fuck. I just had to go here. Hello, Internetians, and welcome back to To The Moon, where last episode we learned a lot of fucked up shit. And I would assume, now that the music's backing out, the shit's only gonna get more and more fucked up. Yo. Where are you going? Uh huh. Way to follow mom's orders, huh? Rebellion. All right, let's keep going. Up here. All right, don't forget to start the watch. Huh. What are you doing? What are you do Oh. Shit, kids got moves. Wow. Okay, so we wandered off the trail and found a cool place. Well, let's face it, we could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. Tigers don't travel in packs, idiot. It was just an expression. A pack of tigers. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Character development, yeah. Yeah? There was a hill outside of the city that we'd stay at. The same one every year. <laughs> we'd watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did, mostly. He just carried the telescope for me. Of course. The thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always, Grandpa always told her that we were just camping hid the telescope inside the car. It's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. Ah, uh, gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh, bless me. Thank me. I'm welcome. <coughs> so in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. <laughs> You're terrible. I know. At least Watts knows he's a dick. It's a shame, though. All these nice memories lost and never found. Who knows how many more like it? Well, as you say, just take it a moment for a moment, right? Mm hmm. <laughs> oh shit, I told you packs of tigers dwell here. What? Oh my god. That's not a tiger. Hello. Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? You're at my spot. Hello, you're at my spot. My name's Johnny. <laughs> I'm terrible. Uh, your spot. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you want to join me? 
Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? Animation! Animation! Just look at him. Did you know there were so many lights in the sky? Yes. Oh, uh, I did too. You said this was your spot, right? Only during the carnival. Not a fan of crowds. Me neither. Me neither. Me neither. 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 Whatever. <laughs> you know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. Uh, okay then. Well, it can't be worse than John. I mean, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. Everyone, even in India? Probably. What's wrong with that? Hmm? What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? <laughs> I wouldn't mind. Just for once, to have the same name as everyone else. It's like those lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them any less pretty. I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are anyways? My dad's my dad said they're giant burning spheres of gas. Oh, I bet he's just making it up. <laughs> well I hate to break it to you, kid, but why would he lie to me? Because, you know, that's what grown ups do. They make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, kangaroos. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff like that. Sorry, kids! Kangaroos are fake! <laughs> Have you ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things, never tried a rabbit, though. Yeah, we'll make the best constellation ever. Let's see who makes one out first. Okay, we'll start in three. Three, two, one, and start. I see it. Or uh, where? In the sky. Um, but where in the sky? Think big. Uh. Bigger than all the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute! I see it! Tell me what you see. Fuck! There, right? There are two ears and a head. What else? And there is its two feet. Yes, what else? And and the moon. The moon is its big round belly. So what do you think? They really. So what do you think they really are? The stars, I mean. 
I... I've never told anyone, but... They've always... I've always thought they were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses, stuck at the far end of the sky. Wow, it must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses out there, and they want to tip, and they want to talk to them. But they can't because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. So that's what they do. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses and at me. Why you? Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. That bag, what's in it? Oh, it's the prize I won from Whack-A-Mole. Did you get to play that game? <laughs> I tried, but I'm too clumsy. What did you get from it? I got a thing. Oh, shit. He got the platypus. I don't really know what it is. Yep. It's some kind of weird duck beaver thing. May I see it? It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny! Ah, it's my ma calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. Mine? Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep. Will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. What if you forget or get lost? Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. Right on the rabbit's tummy. Coming! Oh yeah, I forgot. My hacky sack in the bag. You said you're clumsy, right? Maybe it'll help. Don't look at me like that, you <laughs> fucking piece of shit! Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm next to him. Shut up, Blake! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! Do they ever get lost? Wait, does that mean... Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. And here I thought this was gonna be an inspirational childhood dream story. I should have known that some girl would come along and turn him into a... Turn it into a cheese fest. Fuck you, Watts! You're still a dick! I suppose now we know what we must do to send him to the moon. Wait, are you actually going to do it? Are you? Wait, you're actually going to do it, are you? It's our job, Neil. It's what we are contracted to do. Sorry, I'm yawning. Damn it, Eva, wait! Eva. <laughs> you're in here. Received note. Move. Yes, nice. Oh boy. Move. Objective where Johnny and River are to regroup if they get lost from each other. This is all your fault. Jesus, you're such a dick. Hmm. 
fuck are you doing, Watts? Watts? What are you doing? Turn around. Neil. I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah? Well, I know that you know that I... Look, our contract is to send him to the moon. And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? What? The reason why he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died. I know, but we are legally bound by the contract, specifically... Fuck the contract! I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Eva. Wow! Dr. Watts actually showing some emotion. Holy shit! Maybe he's not so much of a dick. I don't- but I've said that before and took it back, so... I hold out no hope for the future. I don't know about you, but I signed up... <sighs> ...to help the freaking geezer die happy. Me too, and I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'd be in for court hearings. We'll appeal. We know that Johnny'd be happier to not go to the moon. Johnny would be happier with a lot of alternate life tangents needed. <sighs> Excuse me. We are not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. Well, we happen to know what he wants better than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe because I believe in her and what do you mean, risk? You're removing her. <laughs> Besides, I'll make up for it. Make up for it how? We're running out of time. Just trust me. This is the one who pushed me off the fucking lighthouse. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's fun. You just... Powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Eva. Yo, what? Booby traps? Really, Eva? Just trying to buy some time. Gee, thanks for telling me. Move. Can't go. Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. Those are some expensive pieces of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put and wait till I'm done. Oh, piss off. Look, don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Would you really risk dist distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Come and find me and at the end of the hall. <sighs> oh, we're controlling back to Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, you've gotta be freaking kidding. Is this a game to you, Eva? Dear lord, they aren't just zombie Evas. They're zombie Evas. <laughs> and with that pun, we will end this episode. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time for Zombie Eva Slaughter Paradise Monster Mash Black Ops 3 3D. You still hate Neil? Eh. Anyways. Stay interesting, but not too interesting, because there's a cat. <laughs>